What happens when One Punch Man goes to Harry Potter's house? What if he ends up in a fallout shelter? What if he ends up on the moon? I don't know. Let's find out. You know, sometimes in Teardown, we have these really cool ideas. Some are very lame, but some are ambitious. And this is one of the ambitious ones. We are here today to present our Teardown Workshop Map Project, Harry Potter, Witchcraft, and Wizardry. For the time being, curtain features, you can explore Harry Potter's house, but work in progress. We're going to do Prevent Drive, The Leaky Cauldron, Diagon Alley, Hogwarts. They're going to do all of Harry Potter's world here in Teardown. So what better way to check it out than to be One Punch Man? <laughs> I don't think Harry Potter and his family expected something like that. It's Harry Potter's house. And it's the uh, the double-decker bus that we saw in the third movie, if I recall correctly. Hold on, can I um drive the double-decker bus? This is perfectly fine. Press shift to tell Ern to hit it. Wait, Ern was the bus driver in the third movie. Okay, shift, hit it. <laughs> We're going off the edge. Bye! You know what? I need to put headphones on so I can appreciate and enjoy all the amazing thudding sound effects. Here, let me just uh, put on the One Punch Man fist. Actually, you know what? Let me take this off for now because I'm going to want to like go inside and look around. Hi. Just open open the door. Hello? Harry Potter? Are you home? There's some nice pictures on the wall. That looks just like uh, what's the little dude Dudley. Is that his name? And then the uncle. So the uncle right there. Oh, and there's Harry Potter's closet no, open it open it open it up oh, there it is there it is that's where he sleeps that's terrible harry how did you survive in this <gasps> sorry i just broke your light in your bed sorry <sighs> can i open this door please hello dudley's you know thinking back to the movies this is actually a really close replica what's out here oh it's a cute little sitting room outside fantastic do we have any uh any stairs going upstairs actually hold on grow um, Harry Potter lives under the stairs. You literally walked right past the stairs. Let's go upstairs. I hear something. In here? Is this TV on? It was this one. I found it. What a great replica. It would be a shame if something happened to it. If somebody destroyed it. If to start, somebody told Ern to hit it right into the house. Hit it, Ern! Oh my god, if I keep pushing the button, I'm forcing my way through the house! <laughs> oh my god! <laughs> what have I done? Oh my god! I just shot the bus into the sky! Hit it again! Yeah, let's go! Flying bus! It's totally legit! It's totally legit! Oh, the Revengeance Katana! Right through the house! Look at that! <laughs> okay, hold on. If I turn it a different way, I'm just gonna put another slash right through the house. Oh, look at that dude. Okay, enough, 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 enough. Give me the, give me, give me the power, the main power, the huge power, the most powerful power that we are here for the One Punch Man power. One Punch Man has come to Harry Potter's house. Even though he doesn't like the house, doesn't like the people in the house, doesn't like anything about the house, this truck yeah. needs to. That was even above my wildest expectations. Okay, how do I how do I how do I go about punching this house to destruction? Hold on, I put a slash through there, put a slash through there. I have an idea and I just wanna like do this. Okay, this is fine. I think I'm severing the rest of the house, right? Yeah, slice this way, this way, this way. It should be severed. Can I punch it? And I'm gonna punch the I can watch the house. <laughs> that was way more destruction than I thought. Hold on. Oh, man. The amount of destruction I can do, I'm a little bit shocked. Let me just climb inside. Let me just climb inside. Straight up. Like. Oh, my God. Oh, my God. It's landing on my head. Can I actually just break entirely the foundation of this house? This is insane, dude. Punching straight down. Oh, yeah. Oh. Now we're talking! This is why you're one punch man. My work here is completely and utterly done. Look at the dust. Harry, you didn't like your house, right? Oh yeah, yeah. look where Harry. You can still like crawl under there somewhere and, and find some place to sleep. So this is the vault of the future. Yo, this is like fallout. 
Can I drive this disgusting vehicle? Oh my god, I actually can. <laughs> Not that you can go anywhere. <laughs> I think I'm going to walk in there with my Kamehameha. First, I'm going to fly above the vault. Yep. It's just... It's, it's a nondescript location. Just a shattered remnant of a mountain. That's all it is. I think we should go inside and take a look around. I can't really do any damage to the rock faces. I hear bats. You hear that? There's bats. In oh, is that bat right there? Are you a bat? Are you a rat? You were a rat. Now you're gone. Oh, uh, there's so many rats in here. Kill it. I didn't mean to do that. Point blank, Kamehaha's aren't good. Let it go. That did much better. Just gonna keep burning. Oh, rat! Kill the rat! Kill the rat! I don't like rats, man. Rats are gross, dude. Oh, oh, there's the vault over there. But I wanna keep going this way. Rats! <laughs> I was having fun killing the rats. I didn't expect to see rats here in this vault. Let's carefully. Navigate. Nice try, rat. You almost jumped at me. Ah! Vault. Ah! Rats are gross. Somebody died here. Ed. Ed is dead. Ed is dead. How we get into the vault? Vault 13. What's this? Slide mic? Okay. Open the vault. Oh, look. Security footage. Oh, it's so cool. Whoa. Don't mind me. I'm becoming one punch man now that we're entering Vault 13. The ambience, like, it's very interesting. There's an alarm. I feel very uncomfortable right now. Close the vault? Should I have done that? Yeah. Hi. Vault's closed. Can you let me in? I punched the wall. Probably should have done that. How do I? How do I open the door? Oh, open. Hello, mom. Oh, great! It's closed behind me. Exit zone. I can open it. I can open the door. That's reassuring. So, creepy air vents going on. Oh, Nuka Cola! Hey, that's sick. This is so cool. Ugh, more security footage. Open the door. It's an elevator. Okay, before we take the elevator, I want to go in here. Before we take the elevator, I want to go in here. What, what is this? What is this? Okay, open the door. We're clear. I'm waiting for like rats to jump out at me. Okay, it's a bit of a, a, a room. A bit of a room. Wow, great. Great commentary there, Crow. Good job. What's in here? Whatever it is. I'm gonna punch it. Please stand by. Oh, that is so cool. This is so well designed. Nuka-Cola! And I just punched the Nuka-Cola. What if I gonna drink it? I've been sick. Let's go down the elevator. Floor one, floor two, floor three. I believe I'm on floor one right now. Right, yeah, this is floor one. No, no. We wanna go down to floor two. I don't like being able to see down there. Open floor two. Hello, knock, knock. Knock, knock. This is the craziest thing I have ever seen in Teardown. They're individual bedrooms. There was multiple floors in this structure. The jumpsuit. The jumpsuit, it's actually here. This is beyond insane. This is so, so well designed. Every room is unique. Every room is different. Let's go to the third floor. Where, 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 where's the elevator? Elevator, here it is. Okay. We're, go, we're going, we're going down. You know, I kind of want to go explore where I'm not supposed to by punching my way through the walls. Okay, more monitoring. What's going on in here? Oh, a bit of a mess hall. The place of food to eat. Storage. This is a big open space. What's, what's this room here? Hello? What's in here? A science lab? 
This is just so cool. What's in this room? There's more doors. Even more doors. You're here. Good. What? We've got a problem. A big one. What's wrong? The controller chip for our water purification system has given up the ghost. How? We can't make another one. How is this in teardown? Oh, what's in there? What's in that room? What's in that room? Let's go find out. Let's go find out. Let's go find out. This is just so cool. Our survival. Everything about this is just so cool. What is this? This is the coolest map I've ever seen in Teardown. But that's not the only map we need to see. We need to go and see the moon map. After I blow everything up. Oh, I just fell down. Oh, oh, oh. I, I wasn't supposed to come down here. This map is called Coming Home. It's the moon. Complete with ambient music do you hear that and moon gravity oh we gotta do some stuff give me this one point man but oh, i'm gonna punch some stuff dude because you know we can spawn things into the game right right this boat just spawn out a fishing boat right here in the sky and if i punch it <laughs> low gravity let's go come on 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 run 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 get it. yeah i'm trying to punch it can I like throw it in the sky? Oh, that is so cool. We gotta spawn more stuff. Oh look, I'm spawning in Bart Simpson who fell in slow-mo. I punch Bart? Can I punch Bart? I can't punch Bart. Are you kidding me? Uh-oh. Bart's going down. Bart's going down! He's probably gonna break into pieces, landing on the moon. Yep, right into the back of his skull. Oh, Bart. I'm just gonna come over here and spawn in a ramp. Right there. Just a typical standard everyday ramp, right? And then we're gonna spawn in this beautiful pink looking car. And if I hit the ramp on the moon, how far do I go? Let's fight. No, oh, come on. The uneven ground makes this really hard for this simple little car. Oh, this is not working. Oh, I can't get any speed off this car. <laughs> but it is working. I need something a little bit, I need, I need something a little bit faster. Something that, because driving is very difficult on this ground. Or is it because the ground is uneven and you bump into the sky and your wheels just spin in the middle of nowhere with no friction to move forward? So for example, if we spawn, oh God. Oh, I, I just broke the Sonic Runner. Let me in, please. Let me drive the Sonic Runner. I had it. There we go. Can I operate this on the moon? Oh God. <laughs> this is so awkward. Oh, everything about this is so hard. Let's go. Where are we going, dude? Bail out, bail out, man. And the Sonic Runner just got wrecked. I want to try and punch the Sonic Runner at Earth. Can I do it? Bye. Is it? Is can you even reach the Earth? Is the Earth an object you can touch? Hold on. What's that? There's something in the distance. It's a moon rover. There's a moon rover on the well, um, obviously there's a moon rover on the moon. It makes total sense to me. <laughs> Sonic the Hedgehog, One Punch Man, Bart Simpson on the moon. What a weird video. This teardown video has been nuts. I'm the all sorts of things. And part of you are like thinking to yourself, you know, probably you should just drive around on the moon rover. It's like, oh yeah, that's great. Uh, that's great. Um, ready? Oh yeah, look. Wow. This, this is amazing. Look at this go. No, 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 no. No, 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 no. Saitama's got one job. That's going right back to Earth. That is on a return trajectory. What if memory serves me? Saitama needs to get back home. How, how is he going to get home? Well, I've got a great plan. Ladies and gentlemen, I have a personal space shuttle. It's a pocket space. I brought it with me. It's in my pocket. We're now going to, to fly, fly. There we go. We are in space flying over the moon moon in our space shuttle and we're going home ladies and gentlemen i am taking saitama home i am taking him back to earth and nothing is gonna stop me except for what will most likely be an invisible wall yeah yeah actually um the invisible wall will stop me that's great hopefully you guys enjoyed this video if you did click one of the links on the screen and as always guys thank you very much for watching